the Blacklist star Brimley is set to make a huge comeback to screens to assist with another interrogation. NBC's beloved crime series is set to return to NBC for another installment of the task force solving thrilling cases. However, viewers will be in for a treat as two fan-favorite characters will make a huge comeback in the upcoming episodes of The Blacklist. It was previously announced Cynthia Panabaker, played by Deirdre Lovejoy, would make an appearance on the 14th episode of The Blacklist. Although fans were suspicious she could be the one behind Cooper's, Harry Lennox, mysterious phone calls, Panabaker's return is expected to be for more personal reasons. Viewers will also get a rare glimpse into her personal life after her daughter-in-law goes missing. Assuming she would ask for the task force's help to track her down, this could be an emotional episode for the character. Although she does have political power as the United States Senator, the task force has the tools and the skills to fast-track an investigation. It's also yet to be seen what the motives are behind the case of her missing daughter-in-law. While it could be a straightforward investigation, there is always a chance there could be a huge twist which could potentially see her daughter-in-law being held for ransom or kidnapped for revenge. Thankfully for fans, Teddy Brimley, Teddy Koluka, will also be making his comeback to screens for the episode titled, Eva Mason. The show released some first-look images, ahead of the episode's premiere which featured a snap of Brimley. He made his first appearance in season 1 where he was introduced as an interrogator after questioning Mira Malik, Parminda Nagra for her part in the attack which took place at the post office. However, she was clean as Brimley discovered she was being used as a mole to pass on information to Anslow Garrick, Richie Costa. Although Brimley looked as though he wouldn't hurt a fly, he had a very unconventional way of interrogating answers out of people. Viewers have watched in shock as he has used several unique methods of torture to do so. He also used animals to torture people, most famously a goat, llama and camel. After working with Red Raymond, James Spader, for over 19 years Brimley has become a trusted member of his external team. Oh, <laughs> 